Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. My father was extremely wealthy. He wanted the ideal daughter, and he paid a great deal to genetically tailor me. When I learned that my father was more interested in controlling a dynasty than raising a daughter, I left. How'd your father take that? He was less than pleased. Several of his security guards were injured in the process. He knows not to come after me. But this isn't about me. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. So you think your father's tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical, but she deserves a normal life and she's going to get it no matter what. Did your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. I told Cerberus and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nurse Astra docking bay. Jack would like to talk with you, Commander.
You have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. No, you don't understand! I lost it so There we go. Run away, you bastards. Give up your colony plans. Do you have anything flashier? Lawson, I'm glad you've made it. We've had a complication. What happened? Is Ariana all right? She's fine, but you listed a man named Niket as your trusted source. He contacted me, warning that your father has sent Eclipse mercenaries to make a sweep. He suggested that the mercs might be watching for you personally. He's offered to escort Ariana's family to the terminal instead. You didn't mention anything about Niket. He's a friend. He and I go back a, a long way. Do you want to bring in any of your other Ilium contacts, Ms. Lawson? No. You and Niket are the only two I trust on this. What information do you have about the mercenaries? I've confirmed that they're Eclipse, and that they're working for an organization Ms. Lawson warned us about. I could try to alert the authorities, but so far they've done nothing illegal. You made the right decision. We'll handle this ourselves. It's your sister, Miranda. What do you want to do? Lanteo, we'll follow Niket's suggestion. Shepard and I will take the car and draw their attention. Have Niket escort the family to the shuttle. Give him full access to the family's itinerary, just to be safe. Understood, Ms. Lawson. So the plan is for us to get shot down by Eclipse while your sister gets to safety? Eclipse will be under orders to take my sister alive. They won't risk anything that could kill us. I doubt Eclipse will send all their people just to stop you. Do you want to give Niket any backup? Niket can take care of himself. Besides, any armed backup just draws attention to him. I'm ready whenever you are, Miranda. Thank you, Shepard. I appreciate this. I hadn't planned on Eclipse, but they never planned on you. mercenary gunships. They'll be dropping troops in the cargo areas. Put us down in that cover behind them. Let's hope they really do want to I trust you know who I am. Yeah, they said you'd be in the car. You're the bitch that kidnapped our boss's little girl. Kidnapped? This doesn't involve you. I suggest you take your men and go. Think you've got it all lined up, huh? Captain Inyala's already moving in on the kid. She knows about Niket. He won't be helping you. What do you mean, Niket won't be helping us? Nothing you need to worry about. Nobody's gonna get killed unless you do something stupid. You walk away now, the girl goes back to her father, and everybody's happy. Everybody but my sister. And me. Should we be talking to Captain Inyala about this? You don't want to talk to the Captain. She's not as... polite as I am. 
She's the best commando I've ever seen. I've seen her tear people in half with her biotics. And she's getting paid a lot to stop you. She gets in my way, she'll never have a chance to spend it. Wait, Miranda, you said she was your twin sister. That what she told you? No, this crazy bitch kidnapped our boss's baby daughter. He's been looking for her for more than a decade. It's complicated, Shepard. We share the same DNA, just not the same birthday. You took a baby from the richest guy in the galaxy, lady. I don't know what your damage is, but you're not getting away with it. You're not getting Miranda's sister. If you push this, it'll go badly for you. Captain Inyala ordered us to give you one chance to walk away. This whole time we've been talking, my men have been lining up shots. When I say the word, we unleash hell on your squad. So I suggest you walk away nicely, unless you want things to get ugly. Works for me. They're not backing down. Tell Captain Inyala to send backup. Hang on, I've got one of their radios. I'll patch us in, see if I can get an idea of what we're up against. Shepard, I think I owe you an explanation. Ariana is my twin, genetically. But my father grew her when I was a teenager. She was meant to replace me. I couldn't let my father do to her what he did to me. So I rescued her. She's almost a woman now. Why didn't you tell me that we were saving a kid? She's not a child. She'll be 19 this year. But, well, it didn't seem relevant at the time, I suppose. There are people who'd use her against me. I'm very protective when it comes to Oriana. I'm sorry I didn't trust you sooner. You deserved to know. I can understand choosing to go your own way, but you stole a young child from her father. If you knew my father, you would understand. I wasn't the first one he made. I was only the first one he kept. I was brought up with no friends, pushed to meet impossible demands. I wasn't a daughter to him. I was... I don't know what I was. Ariana has had a normal life. I made the right decision. If Eclipse knows where Oriana is, they'll be moving in on her soon. We need to hurry. Agreed. I'm a bit worried by what the Merc said. If they've got to Niket somehow, this is going to be harder than I'd planned. According to the specs I reviewed, we'll need to cut through the cargo processing yard to get to Oriana. Can you tell me anything about the cargo processing yard? We'll be moving through conveyor systems. There'll be a lot of movement. Finding targets won't be easy. We'll need to stay sharp. And these cargo transports carry hazardous materials. So watch what you shoot at. I hope your friend can be trusted. Absolutely. Niket is one of my oldest friends. I guess you could say he was my only real friend. He's the only person I didn't cut ties with when I left my father. Is there a chance your father could be using Niket to get to you? I'm sure he's tried, but Niket's one of the few people who understands what my father is really like. I trusted him with my life when I ran from my father, Shepard. He won't betray me now. Let's go find Niket and Oriana. Right.
they're on the far side of the conveyor line. Time your shots. They've seen us. Letting her get Oriana. Shields have failed.
Maybe the captain knows we're listening in and she's feeding misinformation about Niket making a switch. Or maybe it means something else. Niket wouldn't do that. Damn it, why let this thing go any faster? What makes you so sure that Niket wouldn't turn on you? He could have turned on me when I ran away. I'm sure my father tried to buy him off. If he didn't do it then, why would he do it now? Did Niket know that you took Oriana from your father? No, he just found out about that recently. It was too personal to involve someone else. I never really thought about it, but maybe... No, he'd have to understand why I did it. He knows what I went through. Well, you know him, Miranda. If you don't think he'd betray you, then I'm sure there's another explanation. I don't know, damn it. But I guess we'll find out soon enough. And then I'll have a word with this Captain and Yala. Listen to me. I've got authorization to change their booking. I'm sorry, sir. We're under security lockdown. Until the situation in the cargo terminal is resolved, no passengers can be rebooked. This isn't worth my time, Niket. I get paid regardless of how the girl gets there. No. I was told that I could handle this my way. We're not traumatizing the family any more than we... Miri. This should be fun. <laughs> Niket, you sold me out. How do you want to handle this, Miranda? Why, Niket? You were my friend. You helped me get away from my father. Yes, because you wanted to leave. That was your choice. But if I'd known that you'd stolen a baby... I didn't steal her, I rescued her. From a life of wealth and happiness? You weren't saving her. You were getting back at your father. How did Miranda's father turn you? They told me you kidnapped your baby sister all those years ago. They said I could help get her back peacefully. No trauma to the family. I told them you'd never do that. They could go to hell. And you finally told me what you'd done. I called them back that night. Why didn't you call me, Niket? We've been through a lot. You could have at least let me explain. I deserve to know that you'd stolen your sister, Miri. I deserve to know you were with Cerberus. But I had to hear it from your father first. How much did Miranda's father pay you? A great deal. Damn it, Niket! You were the only one I trusted from that life. He knew you felt that way. That's why he bought me. So you just took his money? Don't get holy with me, Mary. You took his money for years. Whether or not you agree with Miranda, Oriana has been with her family for years now. Her father can still give her a better life. You don't know what my father wants for her. I know that I've been poor, Mary. I didn't much care for it. He wants to take a girl away from the only family she's ever known. Doesn't that tell you what he really is? If you're working for Miranda's father, that means he knows about Oriana. We need to find a new solution. Miranda's father has no information about Oriana. I knew you had spy programs in your father's system, Miri, so I kept it private. I'm the only one who knows. Which means that you're the only loose end. This isn't how I wanted it to end, Niket. Miranda, wait. You don't want to do this. This has to end here, Shepard. My father will keep trying to find Oriana. Maybe Niket can help. Talk to your father. Just say you got here first. Oh, I'll tell him that you hid her. That I don't know where she is. I never want to see you again, Niket. <laughs> Done. Now, if you don't mind, I have a shipment to deliver. You'll die for that, bitch! On our right.
There could be more Eclipse Mercs near the shuttle. I want to make sure Oriana and her family get on safely. I can't believe Niket sold me out. I didn't even see it coming. Even with all your upgrades, you're human just like the rest of us. But I let it get personal and I screwed up. Why didn't you let me kill him? I could have handled that. But watching him get gunned down by that Asari bitch. You still cared for him, even if he betrayed you. You're right. And my father knew it. He used that against me. It's always been like this. My father gave me anything I ever wanted. But there was always a hook, an angle for his long-term plan. I threw away everything he ever gave me when I ran. Except Niket. Weakness on my part? You can't toss aside everything you care about just to be safe. It's okay, Shepard. My father hurt me, but he didn't break me. As much as he tried to turn me into exactly what he wanted, I'm my own person. Any other old friends your father might use against you? No. I cut ties with everyone else. Anyone I'm close to now works for Cerberus. Or you. My father's powerful, but he won't cross the elusive man. You still have Oriana. My father didn't give her to me. I rescued her, but yes, you're right. I still have something. Thank you. No sign of Eclipse. It looks like we're clear. There she is. She's safe. With her family. Come on, we should go. Don't you even want to say hello? It's not about what I want, it's about what's right for her. The less she knows about me, the better. She's got a family. A life. I'll just complicate that for her. She doesn't need any details, but would it really be so bad for her to know she has a sister who loves her? I guess not. Go on. We'll wait here.
then he says, Oh, it's okay. Our amino acids are all different, so it's not like we can get diseases or anything if we go natural. This is the best you have, I'll make do. But you're certain the neural simulators are compatible with both my suit and a solid physiology? 